Hello, morning, ladies. My name is Jess, and welcome to the What If Deku Became a Cyborg or Became a Robot? So, and let's or thing, let's get the, some of the introduction things of out of the way. So, this universe, Zoku, was basically, he's probably the, like, Generator X of My Hero Academia. So, but instead of having, like, the normal skin, he has the skin that allows him to transform into, like, Toga, twice. He's, yeah, I'm looking at you. Oh. Or he looks at, or he can basically do all that stuff. Plus, he can. He also has upgrades powers too. So he basically mechamorph into like his certain parts of his body to the absolute limit that might sound crazy to you but that's okay so yeah that, and plus he can also like when he gets more materials like when he gets touches a machine he absorbs it into his data brain brain so and I'm also throwing in Zoomy so yeah so let's start with usually I start with like them being born let's start with Inko was like working with this this person trying to look but let's say he worked with a guy that's is so chilled oh. this guy so and so they him were like okay or yeah this guy so he was basically course his policy is quirks aren't aren't no no non quirk users like quirkless are not allowed or like they if they are then he'll be like decided or to kick him out. So yeah. When Inko and Asashi got married and had two kids, Zumi and Zuku. And they he went to a quirk doctor and told oh hold Zuku or that Zumi that she's has a fire manipulation. But you, Zuku, you don't have a one. <laughs> or you don't have a quirk. So. 
and they, before I get too ahead of myself, they, they experimented or creating new nanites that allows themselves to clone themselves to make bazillion mm. and sorry makes bazillions of them and they take a form of anyone so Zuku Oh, or Inko was like bring or it let's say it was bring your son to work day so Zumi or no Inko brought Zuku but her boss sorry about that the that was my mom oh, oh like doing it so where we left off the Zuku, or so her boss noticed as he decides to pick up Zuku and drop him into the nanite things. As the nanite means devoured Zuku's his entire body. Like, basically, like... Thing. All the way to... Or, like, there was nothing left. So... Inko was crying... As... He... Says, huh, he was quirkless. Am I wrong? No, but throwing someone's hand in there. So, a couple days have passed. Or, like, as Zuku, or as the Nanites were forming Zuku's entire body, as he lifts himself up. It was like, what happened to me? As he was a new, fresh man. As his, or his memories were a little bit fuzzy. So he gets up and he jumps out of the cage thing. That was a no brainer. As he, as the Nine formed his like skin part all the way across. As from the point thing, this is what he sees as, yeah, he basically says, what happened to me? As the, as he walks, walks to the desk thing, as he sees The rerun of his, of who are those two people, as the computer reacted by seeing the woman that's on the bottom, that's crying her eyes out, is Inko, your mother. There. And the guy that dropped you into the nanites, he's Zuku Midoriya. 
is as let's say it was Tilly. So so he says, huh, Tilly he needs to die. But he goes up as he walks No. As Zuku's no was like as a policeman says freeze faggot as Zuku looks over and the computer her side of him like tells him that he ha only has one bullet or the couple bullets in there as Zuku dodges them and he comes up as he says I won't kill you As he says this. What day is it today? As. As all. Or as the. Like a policeman says. As like. Exact day. Let's say it was a Thursday. So. As he gets up, as he did not feel anything, so, yeah, then he dressed up as a, kind of like him. Change his hair color and hairstyle. So, and his eyes, and so he got the, like, his clothes without a bandage thing part. So, nine years have passed, or nine and a half years have passed. as Zumi so they so let's say they were both 15 as Zuku was basically was 15 too so he goes into UA As Zuku was like, okay. As he was, he took the testing. And I'm skipping the written part. But the robot part was hilarious. All the robots, it just completely ignored Zuku. And they went around him. Him? And some of them are like, what the heck just happened? Can they not see him? And Zuku... As the robots were... But the... Ro he... Basically used his power. His body transforms into blades. Sliced all the robots around. Um. And. The.
after he was done, then he he says, "Huh, that was not so hard." Hmm. As the he gets into class one A, yeah. so yeah. He went from being a quirkless person to a robot. So, yeah. As some of you are might be thinking, but how does he, like... So, he absorbed the... When he, like, touched the... Or when he used a, I mean, direct contact with the number one, the like its armor, like its arms, got absorbed into his body. So, and then number two. Zuko was basically took some of its body parts, robot parts, and number three, he basically absorbs everything. So, yeah. As Zuko was basically had a notebook before. So he Wrote down every quirk. So he used. So now I'm skipping the. Ball throw because he. Calculated on himself. So he threw. The ball into infinite thing. Yeah. As a. He knows that he got infinite. And Zuku was basically and plus before he like walked around the entire house or the entire city she comes out of nowhere. She asked him about um, or can I take a walk with you? Sure. As she walks with him as he or as she says Huh. You're not human at all, aren't you? Yeah. As she says, that's okay. Hey. Your your secret is stay with me. As she wink, winks at him, Um, as Zuku was like a little bit creeped out, um, it was like right after school. Oh, between her and Momo, oh, when. He was walking with Momo and me, Maya, and Momo says, "So, huh? So you're the robot, right? Yeah." As she says, "Yeah, the." I could tell 
inside of his body is nano. Right. My father told me about them. Oh. Um, that the nanites used to belong to oh, some factory before, or like the lab, um, or business, but that business got shut down a couple of days after. Because of some incident. So. As he. Says. As Momo. Couldn't believe that. Because the business. Was her competitive. That ran out of business before. Her business had to shut down. That's only a cover story. As they were like. Wait. So what do you mean? <clears throat> they really did shut it down. And the. Not because it. Something happened in the lab. The owner threw me, or actually, owner threw me into it. As his arm, as his fingers turns into nanites. So she says. So basically, you're. The, so wait, so they're like trying to figure that out. Don't worry. As he, so he tells tells them that don't worry about it. He, he. If I ran into that same owner, I'll make sure he doesn't live anymore. Okay? As... As Momo says, I, I don't know what happened to you, but... Zuku? Who? I know... Or, Deku, I know that you'll be there, or I know I'll be there to make sure that you don't um, do that. As next day, a eh, He shows up as he was wearing like jammies, but then he got trans or like he went from being like in his jammies into that. So when he shows up, as he says, Good morning, Zuku, as everyone says that. <laughs> As sorry about that, my brain having so yeah, so Zuku was basically basically was the Was so like enraged because of that guy. So 
He used like no because his computer brain thing. Hmm. Says to him where he lives. So the next at like after school he goes to his house as he says, May I help you? Yes, the I may I come in first. As Zuku says that Okay. May I tell you something? Do you remember that, like, that foundation that you made? That was directly like experiment thing? And you made a bunch of nanites? Uh, yes, I do. I'm the original owner. <clears throat> or I'm the owner of that place. But did it get shut down by, like, some, like, as he says, I know, as Zuku says, you probably heard of name Zuku Midoriya. As Z he froze, he thought about that poor kid and how it gobbles him up. Him. As he tells him that if I see him, I will, I will apologize to him. Like, it's hurt. Right? He, Zuku, or, I didn't realize it was bring your son to work day. I should have just let it, like, pass. But no, my own law thing, or rule in the company, I couldn't just let it slide. Pain. So, if you see Zuku, or if Zuku was still alive, he, I, and you tell him that I'm sorry, I couldn't just let the it pass. As Zuku says, you know who my real name is? As he says, what? It's Zuku Midoriya is my name. As Zuku, as he's like, Tremon, um, I couldn't believe it's a miracle that he is still alive. As he tells, but he walks up to him and ap still apologizes to him about throwing him into that. And what is the, my stupid rule? As Zuku forgave him, as he tells him, as Zuku told him that about how he felt when when the computer told him that that as he says you're here for revenge or in a hint no no the and I wanted to hear you say that so I accept that as so the next day only th three people knew about his 
like his that he's still alive. Momo, Maya, and him. So, so Momo was like, okay. So, next, next, it was, hold on, please wait for part two.